Hey guys, welcome to my channel and if you're new here, my name is Tanika and today I thought we could do a little online browse at Kmart because from what I have been seeing online, there are so many good new releases and they do take a while to like trickle into store. So I thought if we have a look online, we can see everything, save things to our wish list. I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, let's go into the latest home and living arrivals. Like, okay, first of all, look at this jewelry divider. I've been seeing this everywhere. It is so cute and only $6. And then right next to it, this wave pedestal decor bowl. It kind of looks like the same material. Oh, so chic. Any Beverly Hills Housewives fans out there? Even, okay, this lunchbox. Wow, it looks like it comes apart here. What have we got? The little top compartment with your fork and knife. Okay, this display shelf. Again, just like, yes, Kmart. Absolutely stunning. You could hang that on your wall. You could sit it on a shelf. Even these tea light holders. I love this more like amber looking color. That is so pretty. Ooh, I could, mm. It's not really like the texture like, that I'm using in my house but i love that color all right this scalloped mirror i've been seeing all over tiktok is this not the cutest thing you've ever seen like seriously and only 35 dollars it's very on a trend so well done came out on that one we've got a textured white tray i'm actually after a tray for my bathroom but i need it to be quite big because i want to sit on it like the soap, the toothbrush holder, and like some canisters with earbuds and cotton pads. We've got a white textured soap dispenser. Oh my God, I love it. Like, look at that texture, stunning. The gold doesn't really go with my house, but I can still appreciate a nice soap dispenser. Even these wavy tumbler glasses are super cute. We've also got the tumblers in an amber shade, which is really nice. We've got this checkered pillowcase, which I'm pretty sure there is a matching doona cover. Okay, so we've got the matching toilet brush and tumbler to go with that soap dispenser. And then here is the quilt cover that I was talking about. How nice is that? Okay, this is like my aesthetic here with the rust and the timber. Ooh, I wonder if I should get this one. Okay, hold up, wait a minute. Modular three tier skincare shelf. It's only $15. How good is all of the makeup storage that Kmart has come out with recently? Like they have just nailed it because acrylic makeup storage can be very expensive. So it's nice to have a more affordable option. I know sometimes it can be a bit flimsy, but it'd be interesting to see how that one goes. Oh my God, this petal pot is so cute and I love the color as well. Okay, I think this makeup storage is new. A palette divider, like, oh my God, $6. And then this extendable jewelry stand. I really wanna go check this out because I think it would be such a great way to store all your earrings. I actually think they have another one that has drawers on the side. Well, let's see if we can find that. I know that these water bottles have been popping off because they're kind of like a Frank Green dupe i guess i love that bright pink color mini hair remover that looks like something else if you ask me these chairs 229 dollars for two that's actually like normal dining chair prices so they could be good quality okay here's one of the jewelry boxes see how it's like lined with um it's probably like some kind of felt Oh, I definitely want to pick up this timber stool to put in our spare bathroom. I think that it'll be really handy for when baby comes and I can actually sit on a little stool and not have to lean over the bathtub. And they also just look really cute when you put like a plant and like a candle on them. Okay, I love these bowls. I like eating out of like a bowl plate. It's not quite a deep bowl, but it's definitely not a plate. I don't know, it just does something for me. And these look like a good bowl plate. <laughs> This arch mirror is cute. Look at that. I wonder how big it is. $79. 50 centimeters by 40. A little drawer tray here. I don't know what you'd use it for, but I love anything with compartments that's used for organizing. That would be good if you had like a junk drawer situation. Even though it's a junk drawer, it's always helpful when it's organized. This bath mat is cute. I love the mustard color. I just don't like things with tassels on them. Like I love a tassel, they look great. But when it comes to like rugs, bath mats, cushions, they just get so disgusting quickly. They never look nice. That's a nice basket, isn't it? 
herringbone paper rope basket. Some of their baskets look super cheap and gross, and then you get ones like this that are just like, damn. All right, well, that is pretty much it for the home and living that caught my attention. Let's go into women's latest arrivals and see what's going on there. Oh my God, the Javianas, what the hell? And only $12? They're like 30, 35 at City Beach. I didn't even know Kmart stocked like brands. What's that about? I literally just bought a pair of those black ones like before Christmas. Okay, I know these shorts probably seem so ugly to a lot of people, but I am like mm, eyeing those off. I think they would be really comfortable right now with my bump. <laughs> it's like all I wear. I've got these tights on at the moment. Oh. I don't know how well you can see, but this is my 25 week bump and I just live in bike pants. I haven't had to buy maternity ones yet, so I wonder what these are like because they're looking real comfortable to me. All right, onto the accessories. We've got some bags, wallets, hair clips, mm, a few more like claw clips. Not much speaking out to me, really. Speaking out to me, speaking to me, mm, anyway. Let's look at their shoe latest arrivals. Ooh, <laughs> the Javianas and joggers. Okay, let's just look at shoes in general then. Okay, I know these are like the ugliest shoes ever, but I actually bought a pair from Target the other day to wear around the house because I am feeling that extra weight and I need some cushiony shoes and these are amazing. These Gladiator sandals are super cute. If I wasn't pregnant, I would probably pick them up, but at the moment, I just need shoes that I can slide into. Bending over is getting hard. <laughs> okay, let's jump back into the accessories. We've got some utility crossbody bags. Very on trend at the moment, aren't they? Not really my style, but stunning. I love these little bags here. How cute are they? Oh my God. They're just so cute and I love the pink color. Where is it? Like, come on, look at that. We've got some more little handle bags. Love them. Some quilted versions. I would like it if Kmart come out with more of these shoulder bags because I did actually pick that one up a while ago. But come on, show me what you got. These bags here are so good. I bought one like a year ago, probably longer, and I use it all the time. They're just so big, great when you want to chuck in like a picnic blanket or a towel if you're going to the beach. All right, boring, boring, boring. Let's go into the beauty section and let's have a look at some of the makeup. I did actually do a testing Kmart OXX cosmetics makeup video not that long ago because they did release a whole bunch of new stuff, which was very exciting. And there's actually like quite a few good things in there. Some of the stuff I wasn't able to get that I still want to try is this highlighter stick in champagne. I love a cream highlighter. This overnight lip mask sounds good. Ooh, clear brow gel. I didn't see that last time. I tried this concealer as well and I was pretty impressed. I didn't have high expectations, but it was a beautiful formula. It looked really flawless under the eyes. I was like, what the hell? How is this $4? Oh, they have the e.l.f. brow lift? What? Since when? That is on my to buy list for sure. All right, well, not much else new there. As I said, if you wanna see all the new makeup I tested out, I'll link that down below. Let's go into the home and living section again, but I wanna do like organization. <laughs> okay, we've got a two-tier round table as well. I wonder if that spins. Yes. How good would that be to sit all your skincare in like that? Ooh, gonna have to check that out. I love these clear drawers here. They are my absolute favorite. They come in so many different sizes. I use them all throughout my house. Oh, here's that other jewelry thing I was talking about. Okay, so see how it's got the section for your earrings, but also drawers. I wonder if there's, yeah, see, you can put your rings in the top there. Okay, I really want to pick this one up. How good does that look? I'm sure that the drawers are probably a little bit flimsy. I do love a lot of the Kmart storage, but anything that has a drawer is always a little bit how you going? <laughs> oh, I didn't see this one either. I could use that. Oh, well, actually what I need to do is declutter my eyeshadows, not buy another storage compartment for them. <laughs> okay, can I just say a folding step stool is a must. I bought one when we moved into this house 
and I cannot believe how much I use it. You need a folding step stool in your life. It's great in our pantry for getting up to the high shelves. Um, same with our like cupboards. My first trimester when I was really unwell, I used it as a little seat in front of the toilet for all those times I vomited. <laughs> I just can't believe how much use I get out of it. They're fantastic. I like the look of this clear drawer, how it's got different compartments. Okay, and you can take them out by the looks of it. Ooh, kids storage unit. I always see people use these kind of systems to store their kids toys. I wonder if this one's any good, $100. Let's see the reviews. Painting to put together, <laughs> sounds about right. Someone says it's heavy, so that means it could be pretty decent quality. Very sturdy. Ooh, I might have to keep that one in mind for when we put the baby's room together. I know it'll probably be a while until she starts like playing with toys, but it's always good to know that it's there. Oh, we've also got this one here, the tiered unit six tub. I like that one. I want to get something like this, just a little compact jewelry organizer for when I go away. Not that I'm going away often, but the times I do, I just like throw my jewelry in some kind of case and everything gets tangled. This would be super helpful. Multi-tier laundry hamper. Ooh, that looks cool, doesn't it? And they've actually got like baby stuff in it. A removable basket. I wonder if all the baskets are removable. That looks cool, doesn't it? It's on wheels. I like the look of that. Where would I put it and how would I use it? I don't know, but I like the look of it. Has anyone used something like this? So double hanger closet rod. I thought it could be super helpful for the baby's closet because you know, the clothes are like this big and then you can have two hanging spaces. I'm sure I'll probably fold most of her clothes, but you know, as she grows and gets bigger, that could be a good idea. Oh, I want to get something like this as well. I've seen them at Ikea before. They're like a shoe cabinet. Like they open up like drawers. Oh yeah, like this. And you slide your shoes in there because we need to get a dryer and it's gonna have to go in our garage. And so I need something more tidy and compact to put all our shoes in. So if you've tried this, let me know if it's any good. Oh, I actually brought this basket the other day for the baby's room. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but I thought it was just too cute and it's a really nice quality. I got like a big one and a smaller one. This is what Kmart does to you. It's like, what am I gonna use that for? Well, I don't know, but I'm gonna spend my money on it. All right, well, that is pretty much everything that has caught my attention. If you enjoyed watching, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you have any of these products, if you like any of these products, just leave me a comment down below because you know I love talking Kmart. If you aren't already, you can come and follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. Otherwise, I hope to see you all in the next video. Bye.